Hello everyone, so for my next tutorial I have this watercolor inspired makeup look so if you want to know how to recreate this then please keep on watching. So as always I start by removing any excess makeup from my face. So I then apply my normal routine so I add a bit of primer, some foundation, concealer, translucent powder, bronzer and a bit of blush. So unfortunately I lost footage of me doing my eyebrows but I just used some normal blue water activated paint. So I started this look by working on my eyes. Uh, I made sure I used different shades of blue and different shades of purple and I made sure that they were very diluted. I also blended them out with my fingers to make them look very translucent. Remember that there is no right or wrong when applying these colors. I did them randomly, I just made it up on the spot where I want to apply all the colours. Also for the lips, keep in mind that you make a watercolor inspired look, so do not use any lipstick, just keep using that watercolor activated paint, don't make it look very opaque, make it look very translucent, you don't have to work only on the lips but you can smear it out and stuff, just like I'm doing here, it doesn't have to be neat. Since I did want to make the look as a whole, so not only eyes and lips, but my entire face, I did use a bit of blue and a bit of purple as a contour. It will now look a bit funny, but later on you can see that it really helps complete the look. So since I used a foundation as a base, I'm now splattering on different tones of blues and purples to make everything look as a whole. And I'm now stippling on some white body paint as a highlight.
and as I said earlier the lips need to be messy so I'm here using a bit of darker colors to define the lips a bit more but I am not doing this neat there are no sharp edges I'm also using it on the outer corners of my eyes to darken those a bit so just make it messy and, and it doesn't need to be neat I'm also applying here a bit of highlighter So I also ended up using a bit of dark grey eyeshadow to darken parts of my eyes and also my cheekbones as well and I also applied a bit of mascara. And this is the finished look. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video if you liked it. I will leave the rest of my social media in the description box below as well as the products that I've used. So thank you all for watching and I will see you next time. Bye guys!